Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to The Sonia Show. In a news exclusive, I've learned the brigades have recently attacked two officers transferring a prisoner. The brigades overwhelmed the officers during a refueling stop and released the prisoners. Here tonight is Officer Green, who fortunately survived this brutal attack. Officer Green, can you tell us what happened? Well, me and Officer Thompson were refueling on our way to a more secure facility when we were suddenly attacked by at least 10 brigades. Terrible. These brigades, they're just violent criminals. Is there anything we can do to help? Yeah, if anyone knows anything about the people who did this or have seen these fugitives, call the Sonia hotline or your local authorities at once. Thank you, Officer Green. The gate to the border was open today. Goes to show you how great our nation is because we had, as always, few requests to work offshore. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. In a nutshell, voting for Flores equals voting for violence. Don't vote for violence. Vote for Tyrak. As you know, the Sonia Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. We count on your support. And that has been The Sonia Show. Get your tapes and snacks here. Tapes and snacks. Whoa, don't be such a hater. I don't know if you noticed, but a lot of people don't have jobs, despite what Tyrex economic reports say.
Welcome to Super Supper. Wanna put some coins in my pig? Not even one coin? I got dreams. You think I wanna work here all my life? Whoa, you're worse off than I am. Know what? Herb's in the back, doing whatever it is Herb does. I'm gonna hook you up, but play it cool. And if you want something else, you'll have to get it from the menu. I know what you mean by hitchhiking, but you should stay and try to make a difference here. Vote Flores. Oh, no. This here, ladies and gents, is what you'd call a robbery. Woohoo! Nobody move. Dudes, just take what you want. We got burgers, we got fries. You're safe. Where is it? Uh, well, this is a super surfer. Wrong answer, friendo. I'm holding a shotgun. Well, uh, gun or not, the Super Supper still doesn't have a safe. And who asked you? But Super Supper, like, still has a register, bros. Now you're talking. Mitch, give me that bag for the loot. The bag? I thought you had it. Mitch! You shut your pie hole! The piggy bank! Put the money in the piggy bank! Okay, fine, but that's my piggy bank, man. Okay. Mitch, get the pig. I don't think I should leave the door, Stan. You know, in case uh, someone comes in. Are you killing me, Mitch? Then do it! Take the pig and get everyone's money. Time to donate to the Stan and Mitch Fund. It'll be okay, Richard. I'm so scared. I think my heart's gonna explode. I'm sorry, but I can't. What are you doing? We ain't got all day. I refuse to give these S&M freaks a single penny. We do that, and they win. Can't you see? And you need my money for that plan? Is that it? I wasn't born yesterday. No. Get money in that pig! I won't! I refuse! Kid, I have an idea. But you have Less to trust talking, me. Less talking, more robbing, kid. When the time is right, I'll scream what my head What are you doing? Off. We ain't got and all you day. jump on the guy with the shotgun. Well, somebody has to do something. Oh, fine. Take it. Hey, stuff that pig, kid. We ain't got all day, kid. We don't have all day. You don't know that. Please. His heart can't take this. Just don't yell! Please. That's my money. But my, my husband, he's too panicked to give his. What are you doing? I'm so scared. We ain't got all day. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. All right. Take it. I'm so scared. That's all we have. Please save our lives. What are you Thank doing? You, we ain't got all day. Now hand it over, little lady. You made it rain, kid. Now are you coming with us? Yeah, 
Wouldn't be a good robbery without a hostage. Stan and Mitch rules. Ah, get off of me! Let's go, Mitch! Whoa, you saved our lives. Oh, it's just too bad they got my pig. Oh, dude, my dreams were in that pig.
Before we get much further, I should let you know that I have some anger management issues. Now you know. So, where are we headed today with Happy Taxi? No, it's not on my way, but I'll drop you a ways up here before I turn. You could pay a small fare, too. You'd have time for a snooze, then. We sell scratch tickets if you're feeling lucky. Oh, okay. I take it you don't want to pay a fare. Oh, okay. Now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Let's see who's contacting me now. The Sonya Show! How do they get this number? Just a second. Damn! Piece of no good son of a... I'm feeling much better now. Go on and ask me a question if you want to. I know all kinds of things. Yeah, hope they don't get to certain brigades before I do. Oh, I don't know who that is. I saw you looking at my mags. Are you a fan of dinosaurs? I won't get angry if you aren't. Good. Speaking of dinos, have you seen this movie that came out? Gigantic Park. You're not sure if you've seen the movie Gigantic Park. Hey. Lean forward. I want to show you something. That's a portable VCR. Now I can watch tapes whenever I want. When GP comes out on VHS in Petria, I'll watch it every day. My daughter would have loved Gigantic Park. But she passed away. Lola. But I'll make it right. And in the meantime, I won't think about that terrible thing that happened to her. I'd become very angry if I did. Now just enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. I'll drop you off soon. Engine trouble happens a lot. Sorry about that.
I heard a noise earlier. Like screaming. What was that? You're not lying, are you? The VCR is warm. You watched one of my cassettes. Which cassette did you watch? One is very private to me. Oh, I see. That'll explain the screaming all right. It's pretty hardcore. This is where we part ways. I'm picking up another client. I hope you'll consider riding with Happy Taxi again. Mama Bear. Mama Bear. Goddamn cop. Oh, just Papa Bear's luck. Mama Bear. Mama Bear. Goddamn cop. Oh, just Papa Bear's luck. Mama Bear. Hey, you're not my Mama Bear. You're just some hitchhiking teen. No. <laughs> a date with Mama Bear, but she's police. So I didn't show. I screwed up. And then I got real drunk. No, I, I can't, young cub. You look into Petri as most wanted criminal. I, I can never be with Mama Bear. Mm -hmm. Not even Papa Bear can move this rock. Wait. Nope. Impossible. Come over here. Hey! You see those rocks ahead? Kinda of looks like the border gate, don't it? Goddamn peak collapse. Took Connie away from me. Connie was the love of my life. First love. But I... I don't want to talk about that. I want to race. Come on! Race you up the hill! Oh, faster than the wind! <laughs> Jesus! My knees! You'll never catch me! 
I'll run like the wind! Fast and effortlessly! <laughs> oh, my knees! The pain is excruciating! Oh! Oh! You win! But only because I'm. I'm a. I'm a tad out of shape! A soccer ball. Uh-oh. You've entered the danger zone now. <laughs> All right, young blood. You got five kicks. In high school, my nickname was The Wall. So you know. Hell yeah! The Wall, baby! Four kicks left now. I don't think you're Olympic squad material. Three kicks left. Lucky. That one went through where my fingers used to be. You only got two kicks left. Better make them good. Ooh. I have double vision, and I went for the wrong ball. Just one kick left. I want to see your best, young blood. What's the score? Tell you what, we'll say you have two goals. Yeah, okay. Three. No, no, not a bad score. As a general rule, the wall does better when sober. Ooh, Jesus. Ah, beat. Come on, let's sit over here. Well, it started for a good reason. But now, I'm afraid things are getting too radical. What do you think? We didn't do everything the government said we did. Believe me. Well, I sweated a lot out. Sometimes, when I get drunk, I become the wall. I'm sorry you had to see that. Anyway, I feel better now. Yeah, it's just this whole thing with Mama Bear has brought up the past. And Connie. Well, Connie was the love of my life. But she died ten years ago in the peak collapse. She was my everything, young blood. You should have seen her. Oh yeah, yeah. I got dozens of Mr. Grizzly. Over there. Hmm, well, she was young and committed. Like me. We were in the brigades together. And beautiful. So goddamn beautiful. Oh, I'll miss her for the rest of my days. Mmm, I appreciate that, young blood. Oh, she is. That voice, oof. And she's tough. Tougher than I'll ever be. But kind and funny, too. Mmm, well, maybe we are. But here's the kicker. She's Popo, young cub. And I'm on the wrong side of the law. To make it work, things would have to change. I'd have to turn myself in. I'm a wanted man. Or she'd have to become a revolutionary. <laughs> that it is, young blood. That it is. 
shoot. I, I do. I, I really think I do. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you're pretty wise for a snot-nosed teen. You know that? Uh, maybe you should do one of those dating advice radio shows. Sounds good, young blood. Now, if it's all right with you, I think I'm just gonna sit here a while and enjoy the view. Be safe out there, and if love comes your way, you grab it. Understand me? Welcome to my dope ride. Don't sweat it. Just one runaway helping another. Gotta look out for one another on the streets, you feel me? Say something, homegirl. Don't be one of those weirdo silent writers. They fight for what they believe in. I can respect that. People say they caused the peak to collapse, but I think that's BS. You? Sometimes you gotta be radical, especially when you're living in a dictatorship. <laughs> Dang, I think that's ex-mom. Yeah, she adopted me when I was four, then treated me real well, but homie needed to make a change. Yeah, my life's real complicated. She told me my bio parents were brigades. She knew that, but she never said nothing for 10 years. The supposed terrorist group? Guess I got radical blood coursing through these veins. So, that's why she's ex-mom. And that's why I ran away, and I'm on the road. Alex! Alex! Help! Please! Me too. But it could be some kind of trick. Ex-mom is cunning, yo. Check the scanner at your feet. Alex? Alex? Come in. Alex? You there? Alex? I need your help. Right there, yo. What you want, ex mom? Oh, thank God. Baby, we got a call. The bank near our home's being robbed. I know things aren't great between us right now. But I need you to do your thing and access his cameras and tell me what you see. Yeah, she's 5 -0. I got a complicated pedigree. I'll help you with my super dope tech. 
But that's the last time, woman. Thank you, baby. Big Dog is not a baby. I'm gifted, but I can't do everything. You gotta get in the back. Yeah, I'm in the intel game, yo. Big Brother is watching us, so I'm watching Big Brother. Tweak the antennas to make the image clear, and tell me what you see. Ex-mom, give us a sec. I'm driving and homegirl is in the back. You're what? Yo, chill. We see two burglars, Exma. Male. Got it. You see any hostages? Zero hostages, Exma. Good. Anything else? Homegirl says they're kind of dumb. <laughs> Ugh, not these guys again. Okay, I'll relay all of this. Thank you, baby. Yo, I'm a bit tongue-tied with Ex-Ma. Got any advice? Woman, what I say about calling me baby? Oh, right, sorry, ba- I mean, Alex. Now what? I'm doing okay. I swear. Oh, yeah, I know. You're basically an adult. Yeah. Look, I, I gotta go. Alex. Yeah? You know I love you, right? Yeah. I know. Bye, ex-mom. Sorry you had to see that, homegirl. Yeah, I could, when I know more about my bio-parents. Life, it's complicated, especially when you're 14 and a genius. Anyway, thanks for helping me and ex-ma back there. Hmm, <laughs> maybe that was a little weird. No problem, yo. You would have done the same for me. Cool, cool, cool.
Oh, thank God you're here, kid. You saw that beautiful limo out there, right? That's Sonya's. You gotta deliver that champagne up to her. Do that, and I'll give you a room, and at a discount. I do it myself, but it doesn't seem, uh, classy. And I fired room service last week. They were doing inappropriate things to the food. Of course you will. Ugh, now grab the bottle and get going. Ugh, Sonya doesn't like to wait. Show, go! The elevator's at the end of the hallway. She's in room 307. Sonia. And don't blow this! Yes, Sonia! Jesus Christ! Finally! Put it on the table and get the hell out! Hey! You ever take photos? Not that kind, perv! Just get behind the camera and I'll explain. Chop chop! Okay, here's the scoop. I've sent Adam, my driver, to meet two members of the Black Brigades in the warehouse across the street. While he talks, I want you to take photos. Got it? The terrorist group responsible for the attack in 86. Am I the only educated person in Petria? Down here, you see me? What do I do if they start asking questions? You keep that trap shut! The kid and I'll tell you what to say through the earpiece. Now we wait. Kid, you got any questions? Any at all? Now's the time to ask. Well, you can't deny they killed hundreds in 86. Yeah, the world is more complicated than you think, sugar. Can I pee, Sonya? It burns. For the hundredth time, no! Okay, I'm going in. Hey there, guys. Hey there, guys. Jesus Christ! Evening, Thelonious. If you say so. Sweetie Pie, take a photo. Let's talk inside. This better be good, Thelonious. The important guy's Robert. Head honcho of the Brigades, who's never been photographed. Adam! We can't see you! You gotta make the move! Guys, uh, can we go somewhere else? The Feng Shui is off here, right? You're a very strange man. I got a bad feeling about this, R. Relax. We're looking for info on where Tyrak's gonna be. Thelonious is gonna help us. With that kid Alex's help, maybe we can take him out. Sir Thelonious, what can you tell us about Tyrek? Okay, honey buns, think fast. Numbnuts needs our help. How can I know for sure you two are real brigades? Maybe this is a setup. 
You can't, but waste any more of our time and I'll show you what real brigades look like. There's a new pump. Tyrak uh, will be there for the grand opening. Yeah, surrounded by dozens of secret service. That can't be the only thing you have to tell us. You want more information? You'll have to pay for it. Whoa, whoa! Let's stay cool. Oh, Adam's a trooper. He'll be fine. You're not going anywhere. Tim, search him. He's got an earpiece, R. We need to go. No, we go on the roof. It's time for a more serious discussion. Oh, shut up, kid! Just keep taking photos! Whoever's listening, I sure hope your friend knows how to fly! You idiot! Over there! Ah, at the window. We see you, kid. She's got a camera. I'm going to count backwards from five. If I get to zero and don't have the camera, Thelonious goes over. Got it? Don't you dare give him the camera, honey bunny. That's my story. Five. Four. Sorry, Thelonious. <laughs> Guess the kid made her choice. Ah! Come on, Tim. We're getting out of here. Whoa. That was cold, kid. You just killed Adam. Don't blame this on me. Whoa. I thought I was cold-blooded. Uh, Adam? I mean, Adam! You're alive! It was all the kids doing. I tried to save you, but she saw an opportunity and ran with it. Get out of here, kid, before I throw you through that window. you so long this got anything to do with the guy that just limped through here well anyway here's a few bucks for your help hope she talks about the blue water on her next show I love sewing you so much Fine, I guess. Some people are never happy. I'd hate to be that miserable.
You're lucky I found you. Know that? Both of you. Hey. I am, actually. It's over. I can go home now. Not far from where she found you. Must be a hub back there. Be careful. Yeah. I heard a kid hid in a truck and crossed. I wanted to do that, but there was too much security. Sounds lame, but I can't wait to sleep in my own bed. Here, I listened to this on the road, but I don't need it anymore. Hey, what are you talking about back there? to the nearest station, where you can call your parents. I recognize you from the missing posters, both of you. Your folks must be worried sick. Actually, I'd welcome a little chit chat, kid. My job can be awfully quiet. They don't bother me unless it gets violent. Well, make sure you get registered. All units, we have a code 10. Brigade radio communication in progress. The source is coming from somewhere just off Route 42. Over. Today's my lucky day. I'm gonna finally find this brigade transmitter. Unit 2 here. I'm northbound of 42. Over. What? You sure? The brigades? No, uh-uh. Not my baby. Papa Bear to Mama Bear. You copy? Now's not a good time, Papa Bear. I got two kids in the car. Over. Where are you? You okay? You sound worried. Just stay off Route 42, okay? Promise me, Mama Bear! You broke up. Papa Bear, you still there? Is it me? Or is that billboard ahead?
think we did this. We gotta go. Now! You've been arrested. No one said it would be easy to reach the border, let alone cross it. But for one journey that ends, others are only beginning. <laughs> 